If you are suffering from depression, please seek help. Talk to someone. Commit to work on yourself. You can turn it all around and you do deserve it. You also download T-Stream Fearless Soul inspirational speeches and music, to any device, worldwide. Search Fearless Soul on iTunes, Amazon MP3, Google Play Spotify and Apple Music, or watch free on our YouTube channel. I want you to know that, no matter where you are in life, no matter how low you have sunk, no matter how bleak your situation, this is not the end. This is not the end of your story. This is not the final chapter of your life. I know it may be hard right now. But if you just hang in there, stick it out. Stay with me for a little while. You will find that this tough moment will pass. And if you are committed to using this pain, using it to build your character, finding a greater meaning for the pain, you will find that in time, you can turn your life around and help others going through the same struggles. The world right now is in the middle of a mental health crisis. It's estimated almost half the population suffers from depression at some stage throughout their life. Rather than join the queue, it's important we it's learn why we get down, and then how we can change it, because believe it or not, we create our own negative feelings and we can also ensure that we turn our lives around and be a positive change for others. The reason anyone gets depressed always comes down to the consistent thoughts we think, and the consistent beliefs we hold. Let me say that again. The reason anyone gets depressed always comes down to the consistent thoughts we think, and the consistent beliefs we hold. If I believe I am fat, horrible, ugly, and unworthy of love, I will most likely become depressed or have depression thoughts. If my thought process is I must be in a relationship and earn X amount to be happy I might get depression if I don't achieve those goals. The point here is that anyone that is depressed, is so, because there is an external factor that didn't materialize in their life, I dot e. They have lost something outside of their control, or don't have something that is out of their control. The most common reasons for depression are, a lost a job, relationship breakdowns or non-existence, body image, comparison to others. The only way out of this is to work on yourself, every day. In school we are taught how to get a job, but no one teaches us how to live in a state of happiness. No one teaches us how important our conscious and unconscious thoughts and associations are. Is our happiness not worth more than a job? Yes it is. And before you say, happiness won't pay my bills, happiness will pay your bills, when you realize you will be 10 times more energized, focused, and take positive action in your life, when you first choose to develop yourself as a priority, and then get to all the stuff of the world. I've seen some people, who many would consider to have it all end their life because they thought they were not good enough. A thought, a belief within them told them they were not worthy. These people that many were jealous of, many envious of, were not good enough. You must value yourself enough, to take the time every single day to work on you. To engage in something, that will ensure you are a positive influence on the world. This of course doesn't mean life will suddenly be perfect. The same life challenges will show up, but if your mind is strong, if your mind is at peace, your reaction to the challenging times will be very different. Your reaction will be how can I make this work, not why is this happening to me. And then others will look to you, not with pity but with hope, because your strength will become their hope, their strength. You really can be that powerful. You can ditch the victim story, you can leave the pain behind and focus on how you will react next. How you will react positively. Read. Read all you can read to get your mind in a positive place. Take steps to ensure you will be in a better position next time, whatever pain you are suffering, how can you ensure it won't show again, take little steps, and soon you will be at the top of the staircase. Don't give up. You are worthy. You are more than worthy. You deserve to experience how great life can be, and you owe it to the world to be that positive change for others. To inspire others, who will look to you and say, he did it, she did it, and I can do it too.